Google, you can ask it pretty much anything. So we decided to ask it a few things about the furry fandom and have a look and see what other people were asking on Google about the furry fandom. And let's just say the results that we got might just surprise you. Hello, I'm Shadow Raccoon. And I'm Theodore Rabbit. And today we're going to take a look at things that people ask Google about the furry fandom. this we thought would you know take it into some categories we split yeah. it into five i think different categories and just started typing it into the search box and you know when it starts kind of populating with your search bar you know to suggest things to you we just had a look to see what sort of things google would start suggesting when you asked it questions about the furry fandom because obviously those suggestions are based on common things yeah. people type so the first category we've decided to go for is how do furries so what's the first one we got Okay. How do furries talk? Well, quite easily, to be honest with you, yeah. with our mouths. Yeah, I mean, you know, we can talk in a variety of languages <laughs> here. Um, you know, or maybe you're a silent fern. You don't talk. Not all furries talk. No, it's true. Not every, not you know. every fur. But how do we do it? Well, you know, I'm, I'm not really a scientist or a doctor, and biology wasn't my biggest topic in class, so I can't really explain, you know, the inner workings of the human body on how vocal cords and talking actually no, works. No, orally is mostly. But, um, yeah, that's a really dumb question. <laughs> yeah, we talk like other people, okay? Yeah. We've, we've got our own slang in that. But... Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, if it's all about street slang and so forth like <laughs> you that. You know, you've got, like, a woo and everything we're, else, we're, but... we're down with the a-woos. You know, we are human still. We, we talk exactly how you think we would talk with our mouths. Oh my god. Brilliant. Right. Okay. Well, that's a good start. That was a good start. <laughs> right. How do furries go to the bathroom? Oh my god. Right, okay. Well, so. um, if you're in a fursuit, um, for a lot of us, with great difficulty, Massive um, difficulty. it means desuiting. Um, yeah. Some people do actually have uh, zippers for various reasons <laughs> that I'm not going to go into here. But, you know, I mean, besides that one <laughs> meme photo I think I have seen on the internet with, like, furries in a toilet, um, it, it, you know, um, most of us take our suits off. And then, of course, you're saying furries. Yeah. So, um, Multiple at the same time? Know, we're, a lot of furries start fursuiters, so they just go to the toilet. You know, yeah. how you go to the toilet. No, but normally you just have like a good bladder control. <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically you just have to kind of uh, put up with it. I remember that fur meet where you're yeah, yeah, we know. running around desperately to give a toilet trip in the middle of that. An hour of fursuit walk, desperately crossing my legs. There's a good bit of advice there for some fursuiters is, yeah, pace yourself with drinks. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. yeah um, but then you need to drink. So it's a quandary. It's a, it's a, yeah. Who Googles that though? What no. possesses you to go... I want to know how furries, furries go to the blue. Point. All the things you want to know about the furry fandom, that's the first thing yeah. someone's heart. Mm. How about, like, how does Spider-Man go to the loo? It's much more interesting. Uh, and we're already on question two. What's next? How do furries wear headphones? Okay, um... <laughs> well, you see, us rabbits, we have to have specially custom-made ones because we got such big ears. But uh, as long as you don't mind breaking a normal pair of any... <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I, if I should have actually got a pair in here. If I'd known yeah, this question was in here, I actually would have requested that. But, to be honest with um, you, earbuds work good you know, for me I mean, because they, they're separate. Sony don't, Sony don't quite make headphones that... No, Beats by Dre I mean, aren't gonna work. I'm no, afraid. I mean maybe, maybe they're probably maybe talking about more about should you wear fursuit headphones under your fursuit. I know some people that do that because it yeah. kind of keeps them kind of going and a bit dancey. But I, kind of... I find it's a little bit too cramped. Go on, then what's the next one? How do furries make money? Um, okay. A quick answer on this one. Yeah, go for it. Go answer. for it. Quick answer is most of us have jobs. Yeah. Um, you know that job might be doing YouTube videos itself, or it might be working for a company or a shop or something. Yeah. You know. Um, other people might, um, you know, make money in other ways. Yeah, but, but the easiest way for us is um, to put us on Patreon. It's <laughs> always a good answer. Always a good answer. <laughs> How do fur furries feel about cats? Uh, well, we have a lot of cat friends. Yeah, uh, I, so I, I, I mean, in real life, I like cats. But re They're reality... Cute, Little allergic. I'm allergic to them. It's the only sad thing. Um, but I mean, cat furs are great. Um, yeah. You know, we've got a couple of good cat friends. We've got a lot of good cat friends, to be honest you with you. You know, and members of the cat family. Lions, tigers, 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 tigers. You know, um, 
Yeah, yeah. I, I, I mean, maybe maybe the person who typed that in was kind of thinking a bit more cynically and thinking about a cat with claws and a fursuit. Maybe, yeah, I mean, I won't lie, I, I don't know how safe I'd feel with a cat running around our house. Well, frankly, a lot of people up. do seem quite safe. You just have to kind of keep, I guess, the cat away from scratching your oh, I, I, I know but, a few people who have lost it. Yeah, I mean, that's written cat, in the way that cat. they think that furries are adamantly against cats or something, which we're not. Cats are adorable. No. We're on to the next category now, which is our furries. So, uh, this is going to be a good one. Oh. Go <laughs> on. Ready for this one? Yeah. Are furries illegal in England? Uh, shit. Shit. Um. <laughs> Yeah, what, why would you even, why would you Google this? No, yeah, because seriously. the government has nothing better to do than pass a law that says, I hereby declare that anyone who uh, likes Anfro characters should be banished, be banned. imprisoned. Or, this, is, this is my problem with this one. It's like, why should you be arrested for what you like if what you like is completely harmless? Yeah, exactly. And that is my major problem with that one. So, yeah, I mean, we've got a lot of stupid laws in this country. I'm not going to lie to you. And yeah. I know other countries have a lot of stupid laws, but there's definitely... They keep on coming up with new ones. You know, I mean, there's, there's nothing that says it's illegal to wear, you know... The only situation you might come across the law, maybe you as a furry with a fursuit is the enclosed coverings in public places. Yeah, in, like, in public. You can't walk into a shop. I know, for time. example, Vienna passed quite strict laws about wearing face coverings in public, which weren't targeted directly at furries, but potentially which, have which a bit of an impact Which is quite funny nowadays the with the mask thing. Yeah, it's <laughs> very true. I, it's funny, but, isn't it? It's like, no, we don't want you wearing any face uh, coverings. We want to see your face. Oh. But by the way, now you need to wear a face so covering. So in a flat out answer on that question, no furries are not illegal in England. No. Ah, now this one, this one I can definitely answer quite well. It isn't a stupid question, I think, really. Are furries LGBTQ plus? Uh, yeah. Yes, definitely. Yeah, it's definitely. probably one of the most inclusive fandoms you can go for. I'd like to say that no, not all furries are LGBTQ. No, no, no. Um, I mean, that's a common misconception that every single furry is. Yeah. But, um, you know, it's got a probably a larger percentage share, as has been discovered and discussed by uh, many other people. Yeah. Not just us. No. Um, it's definitely a safe space. You'll find people accepting of everyone. And to be honest with you, yeah, it's a great place to be if you are on that, or you're considering yourself an ally or a friend of it, or yeah. just, you know, a, a side or of Or just body. inclusive in general. Just inclusive, yeah. It's, it's what I love about the fandom. Yeah. Um, um, it's one of his major selling yeah, points. That's a good question. Okay, new category here. Um, <laughs> can furries. So the first question I've got here is, can furries go to a Comic-Con? Yes. And they do. And, and we do. I've done a video on that, actually. Yeah. Um, being a furry at a Comic-Con. You'll see a link up there somewhere. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, definitely. Why, why not? It's, you no. know, I mean, Comic-Con is about pop culture. And, oh, God, you yeah. know, fandoms. Yeah. And subcultures, and quite frankly, I think Comic Con is a fantastic place for furries. I mean, well, you know. I mean, you've also got the fact that cosplay. Uh, well, there's a know, crossover. There's a mass comic. There's a mass crossover. I mean, like I say, I used Star to, Fox. Yes, yeah, <laughs> we used to go as Star Fox. Uh, I used to go as Barney from Five Nights at Freddy's. You know, Freddy's. there's lots of furry. Cosplay related. type things. Yeah. A, if I transition from a cosplayer to a furry, yeah, so, you, you're a Sly Cooper. You know, if, if furries but, couldn't go to Comic Cons, I might not have been so exposed or have become a furry. Exactly. So, this is one for our camera bird, I think. Okay, here we go. Can furries be birds? I should hope so. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's... A... <laughs> yeah, if anyone ever tells you that birds can't be furries, tell them to go fuck themselves. Yeah, pretty much. Um, no, I don't swear much, but... No, 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 I'm so fine. stupid. Fuck them. What the yeah, hell? I don't care. Lots of furries are birds. I mean, um, you know, I mean, from, like, Reg Dove, you've got Adler the Eagle, oh for God. example, he's a big name bird. He's, a good, like, he's definitely a furry. Random bird. <laughs> you know, I know loads of birds. In fact, go to a, a fur con, and you'll find a bird meetup very often. Oh, yeah. You know? <laughs> this one, this one could have a double meaning, this question. I'm not gonna lie. Can furries have pets. Um, yes, I know lots of furries that definitely do have pets. Um, yeah. Sometimes it is a pet of their own species. I, I can't, for example, have a pet raccoon, sadly. No, and Not I can't. I mean, I, knowingly, we you can't. You could have a pet rabbit. I though. could have a pet rabbit, but unfortunately, I'm allergic to rabbits as well. Yeah, that's so. an issue. But, you know, I, I know hamsters who have hamsters. I know cats that have cats. Um, yeah. I know big cats that have small cats because, you know, you can't really have a lion as a pet. No, well. Unless you're Mike Tyson. Then you can. And yeah. then if you're the Toy King, you can be a small cat because if you've got a big cat. Yeah, I mean, you don't want to end up <laughs> on that. Yeah, you don't want to end up on that documentary Netflix did about people oh, having exotic pets. Tiger, tiger guy. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're moving on categories now. We're going on to do furries. Um, do furries say oh whoa? Well, I just did. Yeah. <laughs> 
yeah. Oh, oh, is a popular furry thing to go, oh, oh, what's this? Yeah. That sort of thing. I've used it in some thumbnails. I don't tend to use it in real life, day, every life. No, definitely not. You know, I mean, sometimes I, I kind of want to sit there and work at my desk at work, but, and they're currently one working from home. I was going to say, it's upstairs. <laughs> you know. Um, but, yeah, no, no furries do say, oh, oh. Good old lockdown. But I've, I've seen, I've seen non-furries use, oh, oh, so. Oh, yeah. I've seen brands try to use it in marketing. No, I, I can oh, guarantee. Yeah. food and that sort yeah. of thing. Yeah, I almost so, guarantee you'll we'll see, see tweets when some uh, like companies are using yeah. it and you're like, oh, hello. Yeah, I mean, yeah. don't, don't <laughs> confuse a woo with a woo. A woo if... is actually like that other question. It is illegal to a woo. Mm. Do furries like the Cats movie? No. Yeah. I, Unanimously, I, I, no. I'm in not going to lie, I put it on my furry movies at suck list and no one came to defense of it except one, maybe one person. In fact, no. even the people who made the film asked furries if they for liked it. whether they like yeah. Oh no, it wasn't the, No, it was the newspaper. No, it when was the a... film came out, they went, oh, let's go ask furries if they like it, because that looks furry. They all like it. And they wanted and the said, publicity, no. didn't they? <laughs> and it just went, they just went, no. No, so it horrible. made the news articles, but not for the film, it was against the film. That was it, yeah. Um, do, I so consider right. th um, do I think Cats might become some kind of cult furry movie classic where everyone watches it like it's The Room? It's definitely early I into The I could see that territory. happening. I think it'll probably become the furry version yeah. of The Room. They throw just tuna, with... tuna cans at the screen, that yeah, kind no, of yeah, thing. Yeah, just without Anthony Vaseau, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. Hi, hi, Mark. Well, I know yeah, Rocky no. Horror Picture Show, when it first came out, it was pan. 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 Yeah, it was pan. It was but now it's, and a, now it's cool. a legend. I, I mean, love I think that, the difference though. is is that Rocky Horror Picture Show was trying to be that kind of like cheesy B movie yeah. thing, whereas Cats was trying to be a triple A yeah. film and failed miserably. But yeah, if Cats I was them, I just just go with it, lean into it, mm. and just go with it. Next category now, what do furries? Uh, the first question is, what do furries do? Do. That's a really... Uh, this. Yeah. Um, furries we, do lots of things. We used they, to do more um, things before the lockdown. <laughs> if I want to be sarcastic, furries eat, sleep, talk, have yeah. fun. Yeah. You know, uh, the obvious stuff. But yeah, yeah. No, Go to uh, the if you want to know what furries do is in kind of, what do furries do? I want to join the fandom. Yeah. Uh, we hang out. We yeah. have fun. We make videos sometimes. We wear yeah. fursuits sometimes. Give you that impression. We have meets. <laughs> Uh, we are a community where you can do lots of things. Yeah. Um, generally with an anthropomorphic twist. Yeah. But there's non anthro side to the fandom. You know, you may like even find love furs. in the fandom. Exactly. So furries do lots of I things. I did. I found love in the fandom. Aww. What do furries hate? Um, well, COVID-19. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Um, yeah, we also hate uh, uh, extreme heat. Yeah, I was going to say hot generally weather. Generally speaking. Yeah, the um, summer. Un-air-conditioned <laughs> hotels when you're in first suit. Yeah. Uh, going home from a convention, that's that's always sad. We yeah. We going that. Saying goodbye to friends. Um, people who don't, totally don't understand the furry fandom. Yeah. Uh, people who try and come after the furry fandom. Yeah. Although they usually get their uh, what's for online. Yeah, they get there eventually. And, of course, I think it's easy to say, people who try to tear the fandom apart. Yeah. What do furries look like? Uh, furries look like normal people. Normal people. You never know what a furry looks like until you have a look at their key rings, their backpack with stickers on it, or their furry t -shirt. trash t-shirts. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, final two things here because, um, yeah. We, we decided we wouldn't just type furry things, we just want to see what oh, people no. are asking about ourselves. <laughs> so I typed in, is Shadow go. Raccoon? Is Shadow Raccoon real? Yes, I, I really hope so. I can feel it. I, I look real. Camera bird, do I look real? Yes. <laughs> good, good, good. Right, I'm glad we answered that question. Perfect. And the last one, which is we asked obviously about Theodore. Is Theodore Rabbit, this is good, oh, no. married? Is Theodore Rabbit married? <laughs> No. Da, 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 I'm not. Da, da. I, I currently am not married. <laughs> I might. Well, be I was going to ask if you're married. Who are you married to? Because I'm not say. married. Uh, I was going to say I, I would have seen a ring by now on that thing. Oh uh, dear me. Good luck. Brilliant. I don't know how you'd fit one on there. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, that, 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 that is. Uh, to, to be fair, eventually one day. That is a very weird thing to ask. Yeah, it's very odd, and it was very specific because it was my spelling really? as well. So. Oh dear. 
Ah, dear. So, yeah, those were some things that we found people had searched Google for. We, we found a lot more. Yeah. And, hey, we could always try something like Bing next time if you'd like Oh, no, not Bing again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. So, what sort of things have you seen people search Google about furries for? You know, um, let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, or consider supporting us on Patreon. There's a link in the description below. I'm Shadow Ragoon. And I'm Theodore Rabbit. And we'll see you next time. Bye, Bye. everyone!